Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Snow Moon Games. We are playing The Sims 1 all week. I started yesterday. I did give her money and um, bought a whole bunch of stuff I don't normally play with and proceeded to get her to pass out on the lawn. Um, she is tired, hungry, her energy is down. Social and room. She currently is a pet groomer. I need to charisma to finish that out. She's got a couple of people she's talked to. Um, the house obviously is a good size with good furnishings. The yard's a mess. The upkeep's alright. Layout. Eh, didn't even know that was a thing. Um, she does have some magic ingredients and that's it. She's kind of neat, kind of outgoing, very active, very playful, and kind of nice. Um, her interest, oh yeah, this was a thing. You could buy some stuff and, and they watched TV or did stuff. They actually got interest. So, we're going to hop back in here. And um, I'd rather make her a psychic but that career didn't come up yet um so we're gonna hop back in here get her some uh to wake up and get her to come in here and eat something have a snack don't make the bed oh yeah you can't sleep she you're asleep because she passed out. I forgot about that. So she passed out. So I have to wait until she actually wakes up. And once I click her. You can actually click them and say wake up. So a little bit about me. I started playing The Sims. When it came out. I was. 24. I just see forever ago. Um, I had had my daughter. Well, I was pregnant with my daughter that year, and um, my husband and my best friend came to me, and they were like, "Oh, we want to buy this game." Uh, we're gonna go ahead and go join because I had the computer at the house and I was like, okay. And I worked the rest of that day and came home and my best friend was on the ground laughing because apparently my ex-husband Sim, while my best friend was at work, decided that, oh, she's got a brand new car to take her because she's a gotten a promotion she's gonna need a friend that was the one thing I hated about the Sims one they had to have friends to get promoted and you just didn't have time you go to work every day every day is a Monday So, regardless of anything, every day is a Monday. But since I want to make her a psychic, because I love the paranormal career, we're going to have her look. Psychic phone a friend. Absolutely. That's what I'm talking about. So, we want to make a friend. We're going to have her jump in. Yes. We're going to jump in. We're going to go over to uh, Magic World. Maybe make a friend in Magic World. Magic Town. So. Um, I don't care where we go. I'm not really going to play Magic Town. I loved Magic Town. Oh my gosh. I... When Make and Magic came out, that was probably what I spent the most time on. And at the time, I had already gotten divorced. So, like, I 
absolutely loved this world. This is like my favorite. Ride this, of course. Like, oh my goodness. I loved this game. This was one of my favorites. Now, this is one of the hardest Sims games. Anyway, so I came home, going back to my story, and um, my best friend was on the ground laughing so hard he couldn't talk to me. And my ex-husband and him had made roommates, and literally about 30 sim minutes from my best friend coming home from work, my ex-husband sim decided that he wanted to up his fun by buying fireworks, cut himself on fire, and was proceeding to try to delete the Grim Reaper, because he stupidly saved the game instead of backing out of it. Fun fact, if you don't save when you back out, you lose your progress. This is an auto-save. So, you can actually lose all of your progress. So quite frequently I would go and go through the task manager and close out my game if I didn't like what happened because I didn't want my sim to die. And when I get off this, I think I'm going to go talk to Gunther. Great wave. Um, I'm going to have to have friends, so... Yeah, uh, that just raised all her fun up, so... Let her talk about interest, talk about interest. Never in The Sims 1 do you want to actually jump in with jokes, like... This game was not about the jokes. Like, you had to be good friends with someone. You had to chat. They didn't like being talked about magic or anything. He's, like, not even nice. Mm -hmm. What's our friendship look like with him? Gunther Goss Sr. What the heck? I don't even know. He's a Virgo. Gunther bought his... I can't read that. Mortimer was just a lad. Having amused quite a fortune, he is the founding father of the neighborhood. Oh. That is so awesome. Now, see, these are the things I miss. See if she could joke. About in The Sims uh, 4, it just, just doesn't have that same kind of storyline. I don't like the fact it doesn't progress in the story either. I just wish that my Sim. In Sims 4, like, I wish the neighborhood would progress. Oh, sure, why not? And they would have kids. They would have, like, marriages. Like, if you're not playing with the townies, the NPCs, like, they just don't do anything. They don't progress. I, I want to be able to adopt on their own and, and start raising a family. I feel like it would add a depth to the game that's kind of lacking because it's one thing about Sims 2 and especially 3 that was one of those big staples like as the game progressed the town progressed you would have generations and generations of Sims to play and you just don't get that where is my oh why don't I not click the right thing there? But if they just had that ability where they just like... You got little pop-ups or what have you. Like, you don't get to influence the town. If they're not your played Sims, the rest of the town just keeps going. Because Sims 4, you can do... There's not much repercussion from cheating with someone's spouse. So it doesn't even matter. Like, I don't care that they're married. If I want to... 
did this just not? I told you to buy gumbo and eat. I don't even know what's going on now. Um, pause a second. What is going on? What's this? Make a wish. Wishing wells have been always so great to me. Not really, but we'll just play like they are. Um, I'm going to use the bathroom here. I don't even know what happened, to be honest. I liked all this stuff. Like, I miss this game, but I hate playing this game. Oh, dragons were a thing. I forgot all about that. Talk to. I didn't really get to play much with the magic coins and earn magic coins. You can. Like, you can go up here and perform, like, a um, magic storm. And if you're good at it, which I doubt she will be, um, you will earn magic coins. Okay, let's go home and work on our traits again. So, uh, go home. She didn't really get much of her social up, and no, I don't need a health system. She didn't get much of her social up, and now she's hungry, and her energy is low, and she needs to go t take a shower. So, take a shower. Have a quick dinner and go to bed. Because that's a thing. Oh, nah. You know what? You get to go to work instead. This ought to get fun. Now she's completely miserable. But do not fear because I have done this quite a few times. Yeah, well, you know what? You don't get to. You get to do the things I tell you to do in the order I tell you to do them. And you don't get to bypass and just go to bed. I liked the fly thing. Oh, no. It's very possible I could get a burglar. I do have... Hundreds of thousands of dollars of items out here, but you know what? My signal care. Ah, uh, she's just gonna go to bed. Unfortunately, well, f ironically, she doesn't have a TV or a computer system. Those are your theft items that usually get them. Okay, get up, water these. And I want you to... Oh, wow. What's this? Ooh, feed fish. And play this. And then I want you to use the restroom. Have lunch. I want to see if having lunch is different than the other, like... Okay. Turn butter. Why not? I don't know. I don't even know what that does. She's... She needs something logic. I don't think I got anything logic. No, I don't want you begged. I'm about ready to put this day, the signs out in the front of the yard. Did I get it, not get anything for logic? Um, I don't even know what to get. Uh, sure. Gaze. Uh, 
motorcycle. I did like it in Sims, one of the Sims, I think it was in 2. If you used the telescope, might have been 3. But when you used the telescope during the day, you were considered a peeping Tom. Now that was funny. And in 2, you used to be able to do like the crossword puzzle. Maybe it was 3. I don't know. Like I said, I've been playing since like the very beginning. In fact, I think we played SimCity, me and my best friend, before The Sims, which is how we found out about The Sims coming out. No, please don't go all the way to the table. You're wasting time. Pay the bills. Ooh, the bills are expensive at the moment. Okay. Yeah, I'll recycle this. Find out who's hot. Now, go to work. Yeah, sister, you should get a promotion. But, uh, your needs could be worked on. But, I mean, you're pretty high. I don't think you need anything. Nah, you know. Oh my goodness, this is such a crazy game. Do I have the chemistry set? Oh, that thing was a nightmare. After this, we'll real quick make a wish. Of course I got promoted. You've been promoted to conspiracy theorist. They're out to get you. You just know it. So they're going to pick her up at 11 p.m. to 5 a.m. She's going to bring home 130 today at a bonus of 260. You know, you did not get the kind of money that you can in some of the other games. Okay, let's clean. I hated using this, but we're going to try it out. Okay. Greetings, mortal. I see a conflict in you. Your heart pulls one way and your thoughts of wealth another. I shall summon forth a great blessing on your house. But you must decide on the path. Do you wish for money or do you wish for love? Ah, uh, I got money. We'll wish for love. This is probably a mistake. She'll get an enemy instead. A flood of the house. Uh, would you like this spell cast upon a male or female? Hell. Oopsie da daisy, I waved my hands the wrong way. Someone looks angry. You better cheer them up the old fashioned way. Well, there goes your friendship with, uh, Mortimer, I think. That's okay. It didn't hurt it too much. Okay, what's your move look like? Use. Take a shower real quick. And I'm going to have her practice speech until I decide you're tired enough to go to bed. Uh, the other thing is that you had to work at your actual skills. In Sims 4, when you click on something and they pick it up, you're, boom, level 1. And that's okay, except I feel like that just... Oh, great. She's got roaches on top of the flies. I need to figure out why she's got flies again. But first, she's going to spray that. And then she's going to knock on Bone Hilda. Spray that one. Okay. Just have lunch. Bone Hilda can do the rest. She figured it out. I do like having Bone Hilda. Play this. Of course you are.
Of course you are. <laughs> oh, there we go. Now you're high enough. Answer. Are you kidding? You're a summoner and should decorate accordingly if you want to live most harmonious in your house. Oh, great. Um, let's see if I can... What is he doing? What is that? Oh, the honey. I forgot all about the honey bear. Oh my goodness. What is the color of clean? Show these true colors and you will be made clean. That was another thing. When they released Realm of Magic, I was really hoping that they would have the crystal ball. And they didn't, and I was really not happy with that. I thought that that would have been the perfect path to have that, because that was one of my most favorite things, is... the magic packs, and then I just felt like it was lax. Luster, I guess, would be a good way to put it. Like, I felt like they could have done so much more than they actually did do. And, I don't know, maybe you guys feel differently, but I just feel like there's just so much more that could have been done. Ugh. Come on, the idea is to get the social bunny right before I quit playing. We're gonna get her a better bed. I'm about sick of this. Um, go to seating. Go to bed. Which one's this? T Comfort 10. 10 out of 10. Let's get this one. I don't like the fact that, like, she goes to sleep and then she doesn't get full, and she should get full of energy. Knock. Have lunch. Yeah, you need Bone Hilda to clean up after you. Every time I turn around, you've got flies. Use. Okay, wait a minute. Why is this bathroom just like, why are you so atrocious? That, oh yeah, I had to get rid of the lights. Oh, let's change the lights anyway. Let's get these lights gone. Let's get some better lights in here. Ooh, we could use the chandeliers. I like it. Let's put two in there. We'll get rid of this one. I mean, I got the money this time. And I have one ceiling fan in this room. Although, I will say... Ooh, what if we... Put some photos or something on the wall. I don't even know. Let's add a plant. Oh, there's a plant. Um, let's move him over here for now. I forgot. You can't do that. You gotta take these mother crapping things off. Let's get a better dining room set in here. Almost all of them are square-ish. Um, they 
had some really big cables, did they not? That would be kind of cool. I really think that The Sims 4 should really do, since they did Tiny Living, I think they should do something that has, like, more of a luxurious living feel. Like, I don't know if I would go so far as to say mansion stuff, but, like, I just feel like I want something a little bit more luxurious and maybe you guys don't I don't know but look at this like this stuff isn't in there just unique pictures and I think it's ugly but you had the ability to oh look at that that would have been great in realm of magic who wants bullhorns I mean, to be fair, personally, I would like a return of all these objects in a stuff pack. Like a Sims 1, back to basics, something fun that's just a reminisce of this game. But not just this game, like, I'd take it for The Sims 2 or The Sims 3. I just really like it. The feeling of, oh my goodness, quit your belly aching. There's something to be said about not having friends. Yeah, don't need them. Which probably does for the next job. Nope. Just a point of charisma that I can't get her to seem to work on. Crystal Ball speaks, you are truly clean in mind and in-house. In your personality is now more neat. You gain one neat point. That's not bad. Wow! That was mood. I don't even know what this does. Oh, mechanic skill. Huh. She gets a mechanical skill from this. Oh my goodness, two mechanical skills. Well then, I will say the better your items were, and trust me, in this game it took a while to get there, but the better the items, the better mood you get in. You're going to have to get out of the exotic fish tank and go to work, and what is that? Okay. Well, she's bottomed out, so she did not go to work, but that's okay. Let her mop that up. She has absolutely no social, so the social bunny should come pretty sure to this game. Um, but before, no. Let's revamp the bathroom as well. Now, I know that having better stuff in here will make her happier. This is a hot tub. I feel like this is a bathtub. Oh, I love these bathtubs. Hygiene 10, hygiene 6. Sorry, my phone went off, so I had to pop off a recording. Is this a uh, level 10? Oh, great. It's one of those things. Where, since I popped out, it's going to be all glitchy. Well, um... Let's just get this one. I kind of know where everything's at anyway. Well, let's get this one and we'll get a toilet that's high-end gold toilet. Why not? And we'll go back in here. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's kind of glitchy. 
We'll go back in here and I will just unpause it. And I'm going to have her use the golden throne. And answer her phone. Or not. Um, go to bed. Ugh, I hate it. It doesn't ever stay ringing long enough for her to get it. I loved those pop-ups. I do miss that from the game, too. kind of think that would be fun, like your cell phone just randomly ring, and it'd just be some telemarketer, your uncle died, like it was in this game. Like, that's so cool. Here, have a great breakfast. Did you eat a snack, too? Okay, or just eat snacks. Go knock on Bronhilda. Let her come clean your house. Take a shower. Okay. Have lunch. Let's see if that works again. Nope, just snacks. Use. She needs to practice her speech, but she's too upset. What happened to the game? I think it crashed. No. No. Oh, it crashed. I don't think there's any way to save it. Mm. Yeah, no. Oh, 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 save. Nailed it. That's so awesome. Uh, let's see. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. That was... Whew. We did get it saved. It did save everything. So, I did... I did get that. So, I was waiting to see if the social bunny was going to show up. But it just hasn't yet. Maybe if I make her more miserable... The only problem with that is, is she won't do anything else. Like when they get miserable, they just won't do very much of anything. And why do all these animals want to play with her? Skydive. Oh, please don't die. I know that you're not happy. Play. Easy ride. Okay. So, sleep. Okay, it's almost time to go to work. <laughs> go to work. Do, 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 do. She hasn't paid her bills. Oh my goodness. That's my icon. Okay. We'll just leave them for now. I don't worry about it.
Alrighty then. Why she keeps getting snacks? Oh, yum. Knock and sleep. Have her clean my house while I sleep. Bless this. We're gonna die a death of flies here. What are all your plants? Take some pride in your plants. Why do you keep making food and eating? You were fine. Why did you not water all your plants? Goodness. No. I will start selling stuff. Um, why don't you call a cab and we'll go explore Old Town. Yes. No! Go to the trolley. Oh my goodness. If this trolley leaves, I'm going to be pissed off. Oh my gosh, I am gonna sell that. Call cab. Go to downtown. You know what? Just go to bed. Bro, you can't. It's a dreaded sound. While you're at work, I'm selling those things. And I'm about tired of it. It just takes so long to drain it. I think that's part of the thing I hated about it the first time I, when I first got that. Dude. What time do you come home? Five? Yes. Okay, take a shower. And then we'll go on vacation. $500 for a vacation? We should have done this forever ago. Yes. No. Go here. Yes. Get in. Where do we want to go? Ooh, Yeti. What the heck is that? Oh my goodness. Okay, so she's on vacation. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause it here. We're going to save here. And when we come back, the next time, we will take go ahead and explore this vacation thing and see what it's all about. Oh, I already know this is going to be so much fun. Like, oh, look, 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 look. Oh, Oh, they could snowball fight. Oh, my goodness. Oh, they had the hot tub. Oh. Do you guys remember? If not, if you've never played, this was so much fun. Like, you click the room, and you just go, oh, this is where I'm going to stay. 
Like, that's all you do. Like, you just tell them which one. I think you check in somewhere. I don't remember. Oh, yeah. Check in for 40 bucks. And then you pick a room. Oh, my goodness. Like, look at this. Ugh. There's stuff here that you can explore. Do I do anything else? I don't even remember. I think it just automatically assigns you. Look, you can take your pet on vacation. Oh, oh. you can rent stuff. Uh, like, look, like, check this out. Snowboarding. Uh, I wonder if I can take a screenshot. Let's see. That's not a good one. I feel like that's the icon. Options menu. Save. And the camera. Done. So no bore day. On the twentieth anniversary. Done. All right. So, if you like this and you want to see more, like, comment, subscribe down below. The links are all in the comments. But you know, I'm still gonna play this for another five more days of The Sims One. Um. I do love this game. It's got so many things in it. I would have liked just the one of the careers to be given to us. I mean, they do have all month, and I did read a tweet where they said that it's the first of many, and maybe they've got more plans for the entire month. I don't see why they would have done it across the whole month, but maybe, maybe they're just going to drop in, like, bits and pieces here and there, so I'll keep my eyes open. I mean... I'm not overly stoked that I just got a hot tub and some songs, but I'm not mad. I'm not mad about it. I just wish, I feel like they weren't as excited at The Sims turning 20 years old as us fans were excited that we've been playing it for 20 years. And that's kind of sad and disheartening that the company isn't more excited. I'm not talking about the sim gurus and the game developers. I guarantee they are just as excited. But I mean like the actual company that doesn't... Whoever is in charge of like what they can and can't do isn't as excited that they've got a game that's lasted 20 years and has sold so many I mean I have very rarely met people who don't either a know about the game or b doesn't play the game or c never try the game like somebody falls in one of those three either they played it when they were little but they don't play it anymore they played it since now that they're older they still play it they have played it all along, or they had friends that played it, and it just didn't interest them. But rarely do you ever go, yeah, I play The Sims, and someone look at you and go, what the heck is that? Like, and that's sad. I just feel like they just weren't as excited as all of us. And I know that the Sim all those Sim gurus are just as excited. 
at working on a on this game they put their hearts and soul in it and at some point in the chain from the moment that you're developing to what the budget's allowing you to to actually give in or the content that you, to go in a pack or go into a free patch is limited somewhere and that's sad that's sad but you know hey there's a lot of CC developers out there I'm sure that they'll come up with something I'm sure one of them's gonna eventually come up with a nostalgia pack and I'm gonna be so there for it because uh, yeah I feel like it's needed I feel like it's needed but I heart your face I will be back tomorrow playing some more Sims 1 and um, you all have a wonderful fantastic day and Go ahead and sim away. Bye-bye.